Hi there, welcome to today's video. As I promised, I'm making the video today about how I knew I was pregnant with twins before the ultrasound. In case you don't know me yet, my name is Freya and I am 47 years old and currently pregnant with twins. I'm in my 10th week and we had two embryos transferred in the Czech Republic. These were donated embryos, so we had embryo adoption. And they both stuck. We're really happy about that. Now, I had a lot of things leading up to the transfer that were just so many positive things. And I, I'm a very spiritual person. I am Christian, but I, I'm generally spiritual. So I have been in so many different kind of churches and communities and have read a lot of books and have just spent a lot of time um, studying different, I don't want to call them religions, different backgrounds of faith that I just feel there's there's a lot of truth in, in a lot of them and I love that. I'm also very close to nature so that's another thing that influences me a lot it's just I feel I feel God I feel the power of like everything that's connected when I'm out in nature and I I strongly believe in that like everything is intertwined everything has a reason everything's good for something and everything happens you know because it needs to happen so leading up to the transfer I did tell that story before the day before the transfer I wanted to pack my stuff and I wanted to get that cooler that I was going to have in my car for all my food that I was going to have on the way because I spent a night before I went to check and then I came back that next day and I wanted to have all my own food because you know stuff was still closed because of corona and I wanted to get the cooler got into that box that I thought the cooler was in but there was no cooler in there the cooler was actually not in the box it was beside that and in the box were my maternity clothes from nine years ago when I was pregnant with my daughter and I hadn't accessed I had I had no idea that box was even there hadn't accessed it in nine years or like you know almost nine years and I remember like I thought I had gotten rid of them because I had gotten rid of a lot of stuff because I'm someone's like I just don't want it to sit around for however long. If I need it again, well, then I'll get it again. And the first thing that was on top was a dress that I ended up wearing for the transfer, the day of the transfer. And it was a beautiful dress that you could wear at any time, but it was it's actually a maternity dress. And I wore that for a concert while I was pregnant with my daughter. And it was a really happy day. I have a picture of my partner and I, on the pit on you know on the photo me wearing the dress and we were like really happy together so that was already like a really good karma I felt like this is a good sign so I was gonna wear the dress I wear the dress and then let me back up even more in February I was out with a dog I was out walking and there was a double rainbow. Now rainbows have this very special meaning to me. Of course, it's God's promise, but for me, like rainbow baby also, I had lost two babies. Every time I see a rainbow, or every time I've seen a rainbow in, in the past few years, I always felt like this is, this is the sign, it's gonna happen. It's like, it's the promise. I just have to be patient. I don't know when it's gonna happen, but it's the promise. I'm gonna have my rainbow baby. But in February, I saw a double rainbow, which is not that common. Plus in February, there are not a lot of rainbows around here in Germany around February. I don't know, like I haven't seen that many. And then four days, no, it was, I don't know, two days or four days after the transfer, my neighbor who, you know, who lives across the street, his wife, actually sent me a picture of a double rainbow that was right like on the picture you could see it right above our house our house i put the picture here also she doesn't actually have my number he has my number so he must have told her like please send this to Freya." so i at first i didn't know who it was from and then it said her name i was like oh and she just sent it without comment it's like <laughs> just the double rainbow right above our house 
And that was right after the transfer. That's when I was thinking, yeah. Also, the day of the transfer, when I drove home, I actually, on the way home, I went to buy groceries. There's this like kind of a Sam's Club that's not that close to where we live. Since I was driving by there anyway, I was thinking, okay, let me just go by there and buy some things that I need, like the bulk stuff I need. And when I was in there, I talked to my two little babies. I talked to the embryos and I told them, you know, everything's gonna be okay. You're going with mommy. This is the first time you're going shopping with me here. There are gonna be more times when you're gonna go shopping with me here. And I just felt from day one, I just felt such a connection. I felt like, I said that in my video of the transfer that I made for the transfer. At the end, I said that I feel like they're here now and that's all that counts to me they they are mine now and i feel like that every single day and that i felt like every day i felt like they were there the two babies were there and i treated them like that i treated them every day i told them i love them and even that day when i was sitting in the waiting room to have my first ultrasound i mean i was so nervous but at the same time i felt like no 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 you're here you're both here. Mommy's gonna calm down now. Not stress. I'm gonna see your heartbeats. And that's what happened. I saw their heartbeats that day. Um, so another thing that happened, I don't know, I'm a little weird, but I have this tendency to pick up on like double digits and double something. I started seeing twin everythings, like twin trees like when I go for my walk in the forest, I started see, seeing sets of two everywhere. Maybe that's just me, but I saw it all the time. And to me, that was always like, look, look, there are two again and two again and two. I saw twos. I always saw pairs. And in nature, that's not a thing that you just see like two of something, like two of the same that's very similar. A lot of times it's just all like trees look so different, but two of the same kind, two of the same height, two like this, like really, really close. That's not that common. And I started seeing that. Also, when I looked at the clock, every time I looked at any display, it was always something like 12, 12 or like 11, 11. <laughs> it was always like these repeated numbers. And a lot of times it was something with two, two and uh, the temperature would be 22 and it would be 12 22 so there's like one two 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 and 22 degrees there was a lot of that happening all the time and my daughter she said every single day she had this you know she touched my belly and she always told me yeah one is here and one is here it just went to this corner absolutely they're both there so what well, that was another thing and of course kids could be just like you know they actually they always believe in the good my daughter does but she was so sure about it she was like yeah they're both there and we talked to them both all the time and that's that's why i've been so confident because i feel like it, this is supposed to happen so these are all the signs that i felt told me Another thing, of course, I started feeling nauseous literally two days after the transfer and like then three or four days after the transfer, it really hit me, which I thought like, how can that be possible to already that early on have strong nausea like that? And the symptoms just seemed to be double. And that was because you know there were two in there. There are two in there, right, little babies? There are two in there. And I just knew it. Every day I thought, I told my daughter every day and I told my partner, there's no freaking way there's not two in there because I'm feeling everything double strong, like double the nausea. And I never had that. So my fourth pregnancy, of course, with two losses before, but of course you have a few weeks of being pregnant and you have some experiences up to that point. It had never been that strong. So that's all the clues were like, okay, 
I'm, I, I'll be darned if there's not two in there. I said that all the time. In German, there's a saying. It's a funny saying, but this it says, Ich fressen Besen, which means I'll eat a broom if that's not the case. It's like, I'll be darned. And I always told my daughter, I'll eat a broom if there's not twins in there. And she's like, really? Then you're going to have to eat a broom if it's not the case. And I'm like, yeah, I'll take that, but be because I'm so sure. So those are all the signs. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed for more updates and I'll talk to you soon. My dog's barking. Someone just rang the doorbell. Bye.